Yo, what's going on guys? And today we have another quick update to Dragon Ball Fighters. Yes, we got two new characters as promised or revealed, I should rather say, from Evo this past weekend from the Trunks reveal. And this time we got Krillin and Piccolo. Now, personally, I was expecting Android 17 and 18 considering that that would have been perfect timing to follow Trunks because hello, the whole Android saga. But anyway, I'm actually going to reference Gematsu.com, which is where I'm pulling this information because I did want to provide you guys with some translated info because the graphic that you're seeing in front of you right now is obviously in full Nippon. So here we go. Piccolo has technical skills such as extending his arms to grasp his opponent and charge technique. So that's no surprise there. He has a variety of methods to break the opponent's guard. He can fire beams at super high speeds. By long pressing the button, he can charge up for a stronger attack. He also has a technique that fires a key blast to deal great damage. When connecting from a combo, it will deal even greater damage. I don't know if this is out of five, but I'm guessing it might be. Power is three, speed two, reach is four, technique four, energy three. So it doesn't look, it looks like Piccolo is not that bad of a character. I feel like he might be one of those characters that players that are familiar with maybe Dal Sim or even Chandler from Pokémon Tournament, they might go towards a character like Piccolo if they like to keep away and being effective at the same time, especially with that long reach that he has, extending his arm. So that will probably be something of use to those types of players. Krillin has low power and reach, but can use a variety of techniques. He can even use Kamehameha. <laughs> Meaning fighting from a distance should not be a problem. He can use skills to confuse the enemy, such as the after image technique, which leaves behind an image of Krillin before turning into an attack. He can also use Destructo Disc or the Kienzan, which is impossible to guard against. Now this right here, I'm wondering if they actually are telling us that it's unblockable, but that remains to be seen. After firing Key Blast, Krillin can alter their trajectory and have them explode in the sky to shoot out multiple Key Blasts. Krillin's base powers are power is two, speed is three, reach is one, technique is four, and energy is four. Again, this game is looking pretty balanced around when it comes to the overall skill allotment, if you will. It seems like where people might falter, they are obviously better in other areas, which is uh, which is very good to see. I'm actually really looking forward to his trajectory and being able to time blasts in the air and shooting out multiple key blasts, all that kind of stuff. I want to see how his after image technique works in game. And I really most importantly want to see what they mean exactly by the Destructo Discord. They're just trying to be wordy here and make him sound like it's way better than what it actually is. And another fun fact that the V-Jump issue this month revealed is that players will be able to control chibi characters in the online mode, much similar to the online system in the Guilty Gear Exert series, that those chibi characters will be able to battle against each other. But let me know what you guys think about Krillin and Piccolo. Were you guys expecting other characters? Are you guys excited for Krillin and Piccolo? Will you give them a shot? I know personally, I will definitely try out Piccolo. Krillin, probably, I'll probably give every character a fair shot. Don't worry, check back for more Dragon Ball Fighters news as soon as it comes out. Best believe it's gonna be here on the Uchi Games channel. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Like, share, subscribe, Hit me up on Twitter and the Discord, especially on the Discord. Make sure to follow me on Twitch for more fighting game, Dragon Ball Fighters esque content. We can talk about this and plenty more while I play some games. And I'll see y'all next time.